you have enough on your plate. Take me off your plate. You focus on the people in the room who matter most, the people in the room who are busy, that are, that are showing up at this meeting, conference, event. They see a woman walk up on the stage and they think, man, I got a lot going on. I'm busy. This better be good. Please welcome to the stage today, Molly Fletcher. For more than 15 years, I was a sports agent and I had a front row seat to peak performance, to the mindset of the best athletes and coaches in the world. My favorite thing is walking out on that stage and within the first couple seconds, grabbing them. You can imagine after almost two decades as a sports agent, I have a stack of stories. He said, look, Molly, this is a difficult golf course. He said, guys are gonna bogey holes out here. They're gonna double bogey holes. They're gonna miss fairways. They're gonna miss putts they should make. He goes, but you know what the best do? They reset and recover fast. I know what it takes to help the world's greatest athletes reach their potential. And now I use that same framework to help people just like you. How do we act like we have the business before we have the business? How do we behave in a way that sends a message this relationship really matters? We follow leaders who have drive and most importantly, who help unlock the drive inside of us. I've been fortunate enough to speak in arenas with 15,000 people, to leadership teams, to sales teams, opening and closing conferences, and to all women audiences. She was amazing, just very impactful, very strong energy. So she's very confident and I love that and I feel like we need that spread more around the world. So thank you, Molly. I can honestly say that after over a thousand keynotes, every single one is a little bit different. I customize my messaging based on what the organization is navigating. I understand that every single time, I gotta bring it. I wanna show up with the kind of energy that you expect and that they need so that we can take every single head and heart in that room exactly where we all want them to go. How many people have folks who call you on the phone, right? So they call you on the phone and you look down and you see their name on your phone and you go, oh my God. <laughs> right, like you see their name and you're like, you gotta be joking me, what do you want? Isn't decline a wonderful feature, people? Gosh, what would it look like if I took all that energy that I'm pouring into this one relationship and put it over here with my team of agents, my 300 athletes and coaches, what would that look like? I'm a huge fan. I have watched her online. I've been able to read her books. I've read and actually listened to her podcasts. And our speaker, her name is Molly Fletcher, and she's a trailblazer in every sense of the word. She was just authentic, and I love the fact that she just was real and gave us a bunch of information that, I mean, it's going to last with me forever. Here's the thing that I would challenge you to do, to recognize the power in being present. And recognizing the power in controlling what you can control and let go of what you can't. There's so much right now that we can't control, but boy, there's a lot that we can our attitude, our mindset, our effort, our discipline. That was inspiring to go, yes, yes, yes. So Molly's gonna come up here, not as the female Jerry Maguire, but as the badass boss that she is. To step and to lean and to, and to go for it. It was a metaphor that I leaned into when I stepped into the world as a sports agent when there was no other women. I would challenge you as you leave this time together, step in, lean in, and go for it because it's a time for greatness. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, what matters is that I lead people to a new place, that I inspire them to be a better version of themselves, that I help connect them to the people that they lead and serve in a way that's sustainable, that's everlasting, personally and professionally.